What's up, THM Unbox? In this video, I'm going to be talking about the Bright Tech LED lamp. And this is an insane lamp that I found and it was super unique, so I decided to purchase it for a couple of reasons. So this is an LED hanging light and it is a very unique design and I really haven't seen that many designs like it. Not only is it a very slim body, but it also extends over your workspace, which is very interesting. Uh, most lamps either sit in the corner and angle light with like a spotlight, but this light instead wraps around with a very thin frame and provides light for the area that you're working on. And I bought this for like two or three main reasons. And the first reason is the fact that we are in a global pandemic and during that I have to do schoolwork and other work online and I haven't been going into places so I needed a workplace to work and I set that up in my basement and that's where we are currently and the basement is kind of annoying because it's either I have all the lights on and it's super bright like turn basement on all right turning on the basement and everything around me is just super bright and it's annoying and distracting and I just feel like I'm surrounded by light. Or it's too dark. Okay, turning off the basement. And now this light's off, the only light that is shining is my camera light and I obviously don't want to have that on all the time. But my workspace is pretty dark when I'm trying to work. Also when you saw the light previously, that was on its lowest brightness, now it's on its highest. And that was the first reason I wanted a light to cover my workspace and that wasn't annoying like the basement lights and I didn't want it to be too dark. So that is the first reason I decided to get this light. The second reason I wanted to get this light was the fact that it's great for reading. So this light, as you can see, is a lot warmer tone. And at first I kind of didn't like this idea because I usually prefer bright white LEDs. It's more futuristic, but this orange glow is amazing. When you're reading paper, I was doing homework on line paper and I was reading a couple books and reading a magazine. And when you have this warmer color that's more like sunlight, it is way better for reading and it's way easier to see than that bright white light. Another great thing is it is kind of like sunlight. So I've already had this for a day and it makes me feel like I'm by a window or something when this is on. It's really great because it's kind of giving me that natural glow. And some people suffer from that during the summer when they don't get exposure to light because of the light cycles. So this could be a good way if you want to have extra light. And number three for the reason that I wanted to get this was the fact that it was movable. I don't know if I could advertise this as a selling thing. I'm not sponsored by this thing at all. I bought this myself. It was pretty expensive. It's more expensive than a usual light. Um, It's currently $99 but it's on sale for 75. So this was not sponsored. I am no way affiliated with this company. There is a link down below and through that link, I will get an affiliate commission, but I'll try providing the best link, hopefully at the lowest price available. So that is a disclosure, but I, did, I paid for this completely. And there is no way I'm gonna make that much money back through that link. But anyways, the third reason is the fact that this light can kind of pivot. So I have my desk right here and I have a couch to my side. So what I can do with the light is I can actually just grab it from the top and bottom and swing it over and then I can have it on my couch and that way I'm able to read and I don't need to buy a second lamp for that to work. And I really like the design of this, especially when you're sitting under the lamp because the lamp curves over your body. So, so it's not just like a bright spotlight in one direction, it's diffused over your entire body while you're reading and I think that's super cool and super unique and that's really why I wanted to pick this light up. So this lamp is supposed to be eco-friendly and I really haven't noticed anything and I've only had this for about a day, so that's why. So I can't really say anything toward that, that's only from the Amazon description. But what is cool, it does have three modes so this is currently its brightest mode then that's its medium brightness and then it's low brightness and then it's just off this is kind of annoying if you have an Alexa or a Google Home or an Apple smart plug and you want to try using voice control to turn it on I did read in one of the reviews that someone duct taped the little uh, controller that you have to press down and when they ask Google or Alexa to power it if you tape the power controller down It'll automatically turn on to its brightest setting like that I haven't set that up, but I probably will so if you want to see a video on that if you want a better tutorial or a better explainer on that Let me know this was on Amazon I tried looking for it cheaper on eBay or Walmart like you usually can do but I was really only able to find this on Amazon And I believe it had over 2,000 positive reviews. That's kind of a good thing um, That's one of the reasons I bought it because I was kind of nervous about buying it or not But I saw it had some reviews and I tried looking for video reviews and I couldn't find any so hopefully this is good for you um, but the design aesthetic is pretty interesting um, it is pretty futuristic but if you want older style this might not be the best light for you so that flaw with the wireless starting could be annoying and the other flaw is it is a little bit flimsy the base was really sturdy but just the bar in general if you tap it a little it'll wiggle and it doesn't just stop wiggling it wiggles for a little bit longer like it's still going but what can you expect with such a thin and robust light so that is my overall review I really like the temperature and I think it's pretty cool I might even use it for some of my videos just as a nice aesthetic it is a little bit weird with that curve but I personally am okay with it if you don't like that design this might not be the lamp for you but like I said I couldn't really find any competitors like this 
um, especially for the price because when you're buying lamps, they can be pretty pricey. I feel like there's like a small range where you can buy lamps from like 20 to $40. And then after that, they're like a hundred dollars because there's just that big gap. It's, it's kind of weird, but I will leave a link down below. If you want to check this out, thank you for watching. If you want another video on this or my review in the future, after I get more used to it, let me know. One other thing I guess I can talk about is assembly. So it came in, I believe three parts. This LED tube actually comes off. So this is the LED light tube and it's shipped like this. Then the stand of the actual rod comes out and then it comes out of the metal base. So those are the three main parts. And of course it has the power converter. And yeah, you can just stick this back in and there you go. It is a pretty tall light, which is nice. I didn't want anything too short. And I do love how it has that length. It gives you a lot of diverse light in a specific area like your workspace. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Take it easy. Peace.